everyone. Thank you so much for stopping in today to see what I am up to. And I know you saw from the title, I have a box from Globe In. And this is a box. I have not even slipped the tape yet, which I will do right now. This is a box that I have been following on social media, Instagram. Um, I think just Instagram. I've been following them on Facebook for a long time now and have always thought about getting, of course, I cannot open this box. I usually, oops, there's a card coming out. I usually open these off camera so that I don't hurt myself because these boxes sometimes are very difficult for me. Um, that I've been looking at for a long time. And I don't know why I never got it, honestly. I'm just being honest. I mean, with all the other boxes, I guess that is why. But... Oh, this is a pretty box when you first open it. I'm going to give you a sneak, a little sneak peek of the inside. It is a heavy box. So I'm going to try to leave it off to the side of me the best I can without hitting the camera. So I'm going to give you some information on Globin. Um, prior to taking any of these items out, I'm excited. I did get to pick the box that I wanted sent to me. And this was kindly sent to me from Globin. And I so appreciate them sending this to me to share with all of you. Like I said, I got to choose the box. I'm trying to think if there were five or six boxes that I could choose from for them to send to me. It came very promptly and very quickly. It did come right before Christmas, so I wasn't able to film it and get it out until now, which is fine. But um, so with this box, uh, let me see. Globin is a sustainable subscription subscription box that supports artisans in remote communities and countries. I think that's phenomenal that um, it helps, you know, give them a business and keep them uh, in a trade and employed. Um, I do have a link. I'm trying to look at the paper that they gave me. If you use the coupon code in all caps, and it will be in the description box down below, and I'll pop it up on the screen also, my first name, Maureen. You will receive, and then there will be a, a link that you can click on also that will take you directly, and then you can still use the code Maureen, and that'll save you 50%, will give you a 50% discount off your first box in a three-month or better uh, subscription, the three or the six-month, I think, what they offer, which is really, really nice to them. They ship to the USA and Canada only right now um, for those that are in the USA and Canada. Uh, if you want to do this box on a monthly basis, which you can, is $40 a month. If you do a three-month subscription, it works out to be $38 a month. And then a six-month subscription works out to $35 a month, which is really affordable considering all the other boxes we get. And it's always nice to get this kind of a box. Um, I think normally on a month-to-month -month basis, you do get to choose the theme of your box. And... Anytime I've ever looked at their site, anywhere upwards, if not slightly over 15 different theme boxes to pick from. So you can get a little sneak peek as to what's in the boxes, what will fit your lifestyle. This would be a great gift, birthday gift. This would have made a great Christmas gift if, you know, if I could have gotten this in sooner than the, you know, right before the holidays. An anniversary gift, a just because gift, um, really just for anything somebody starting, you know, their, um, you know, with a new apartment or a new home, just all those, a baby shower gift. Some of these would be great baby shower gifts, housewarming gifts, um, just all that kind of stuff, engagement gifts. I, there's just a million reasons that you could give this box as a gift. And the box that I chose is the patisserie box. And I was excited for this one because I love to cook and bake. And um, I think that one of the options in here can be used for multiple multiple reasons not just for baked goods which is like um and you can also you choose add-ons to your box each uh, month and i'm trying to think you can choose your add-ons from the first of the month till the 10th of the month and i would assume they ship with your box uh, you know i have i don't have any information on that and um they do have spoilers that they release on their instagram and their facebook pages and i will list them down below also if you wanted to um, go check out some spoilers, probably for the January boxes. Just trying to think what other information I wrote down here. Um, I know they sent me an email with information. 
Um, you can select your box theme from the 1st to the 15th each month, and then your add-ons from the 1st to the 10th. Um, they have anywhere, like they said, from 10 to 15 box themes to, to select from. Sometimes they have even more. They always have spoilers for up, upcoming boxes. And I think that's basically all the information that I have on Globin. Um, like I said, I've been looking at this for so long and um, find it very exciting. So I'll give you a little sneak peek as to the card in my box. This is the patisserie box that I chose because it will fit my lifestyle. So I'm just going to unbox this off to the side and get rid of all the paper. I think it's well packaged. I know this might fall over, so I'm trying to be careful here. I'm trying to lean it towards me a little bit more. So the first item is in this box, which I'm excited for. Let's see, this is taped. I did put the scissors behind me just to keep them out in case things were taped up. Oh, this looks so nice. Oh, look at this. This is beautiful. This is a rolling pin. I have a wood one, but sometimes they're not great because this is cold and cool. So when you're rolling out doughs for cookies, for pies, the um, maybe it won't stick as much. I mean, you still have to flour a rolling pin, but that is gorgeous. Oh, I'm happy to receive that. And this would go perfect in my kitchen with the greens. And I guess it's either black or blue. I'm not really sure. I just don't want that rolling off. So we'll leave that sit there. Like I said, well packaged. There's tons of packing in here to make sure nothing gets damaged. Let's just get all this out. <laughs> it's just endless packing, which is great. And then I have this box here. That, which I'm not sure. Oh, I think I know what that is. That. I'm going to make sure the things here and then we'll get rid of the box so that I'm not messing around with the box. Okay, the next item in the box is right here. And this is your, um, and this is made in India. I'm not sure that says where it's made. I don't see a sticker at all. I don't know where that comes from. But here, this is, you know, like you could use this for, um, you know, to frost things. Um, you could use this if you're putting out a nice dish for um, like butters or spreads, cheese spreads, but this is really pretty. I'm trying to pull that up right there. So this is really nice and that's made in India. I love that. And then I'm not gonna show you this right away because I wanna show you this. Of course, all my papers just hit the floor. Let's see how this is already open. Okay. So this is the box right here that I'm opening. I want to try to get this out carefully. Oh, I'm so excited for this. I'm very, very excited for this. And this is taped. So we're just going to cut the tape. I don't want to damage anything. Okay, what I see is a whole bunch of wrapped up packages. So let's unwrap these and see what we have. This is exciting. Christmas all over again. And this is the little separator stand. Let's get rid of this. There's another package. Everything is very well packaged. It was well packaged inside the box. Oh, this is pretty. So this is the top portion right here. So let's. There's another little package here. Well, like cardboard paper and then wrapped more paper. I mean, very well packaged. I'm impressed. Made in India, so this, is, so this is like a dish right here. My dog is right next to me. So let's, oh, clunk. What do I want to do? Do that. Everything is so well packaged. I'm pleased with that. Oh, this is beautiful. Wow. Wow. Don't drop it. So this is what this layer looks like right here. I'm trying to be very careful so that nothing gets damaged. I mean, it made it all the way to me. I don't want to damage it. Oh, this is prettier than I thought in person. You know, when you see a picture. So this is a cake stand. So give me one moment and I'm going to assemble this and I'll be right back. 
Okay, I wanted to just real fast show you, I just assembled the, this little cake stand. Um, really any, not just cake. I mean, I'll show you a little side view. I mean, it is adorable. And the little dish there, you know, to, to stand it. And you can, you know, let that fold over. And in this little package, which I didn't know would come with it. Let's open this up. And I'll show you real fast. I was thinking of something similar, but I didn't realize this was, the edges were really um, decorated nice. But these, I'm just going to, well, these are beautiful, all different. You can see here all different kinds of designs. Just trying to spread them all out here that you could put on, I would assume, on, on the dish. Um... And they do look like they connect. I don't know how you would do that. I guess just lay them flat. Would they connect like that maybe on the bottom? I'm not sure. I'd have to play with these. Let's do these three down here. I mean, they definitely look like they would connect. And maybe just the two up here or three. No, I guess you would have to still use three. Or maybe just do this for the bottom. So I'll just show you a little example of this. Like you would connect these. They have like little ends and then a hole on this side. So if you wanted to... You know make it fancy on the bottom and have this be there I don't know if you guys can see that or not have it just come around the edge i was also thinking i didn't know that these came in there is there more than one here yeah there's probably there's two of these is there two of everything that's very thick oh plus it you could probably use the other side too just as nah probably just the printed side i was thinking about getting the doilies that have the you know the design on them to put on here and just put a slit in them to or use parchment paper anything like that this way your actual plate does not get dirty um which i don't think would be a big deal personally now this i think since it is white i think it would go with most people's kitchens that you could put you know danish um donuts bagels cream cheese or like lox and bagels whatever you like you could um you know muffins and little um just you name it chocolates all do, you know biscotti all, all different things what i think this would to leave out all year round you could put bananas you could put um if you wanted like lemons or your onions and whatever like any fruit that you would want to leave out to leave this out on your counter i think is very visually pleasing and very pretty i'm just going to rest this back here so i definitely think that that is a beautiful set in this you know you just to let that fall but i think to put something like this on your countertop would look lovely so this is the box from globe in tell me what you thought about this one i love that they contacted me and wanted to send me a box um like they could read my mind that i have been loving their boxes i mean i probably checked out their social media page every month to see what boxes they had i would if i was searching for boxes i would go to their page and always look i would see some unboxings of this on youtube and I guess with finding this one or finding that one or always wanting to maybe concentrate on beauty boxes that I didn't get this one, but I'm more now, I'm happy with the beauty boxes I have, but loving to find more boxes like this to bring to all of you to share all these goodies. So you've got the cake stand, the, you know, the spatula that you could use for butter, for to ice a cake or, or cupcakes, um, to use for dips, cheese dips or anything like that. And then this beautiful rolling pin, I mean, this is gorgeous in itself. Completely stunning. I love it. You can see the design. It's not super heavy, so it's not something that if you have problems with your hands, you know, with arthritis, we can, so that you would have a problem with that. And sometimes I think they might be better than the wood rolling pins, honestly. So tell me all down below what you thought of the items that I received in the patissiery box. I think this is a great one. I know I will utilize every piece. Um, a lot of times if I make pie, I like to make my own crust. It just tastes better to me. I don't like a lot of store-bought crust every once in a while. It's not bad. But I think this is going to sit out on my counter. And when I'm not using it for, uh, you know, company or just putting out muffins and, and or chocolates, whatever, that I could keep my bananas, my tom like put bananas down below, my t few tomatoes that I leave out on the counter until I'm ready to use them, put them on the top. Um, sometimes, you know, if you have a few lemons, you can put them out. Or if you wanted it just for decoration, you can get the fake fruit. 
or put some really pretty dried flowers on it. There's just, I think, endless opportunities to use this cake stand if that's what you, you know you want. It's designed for, but you can figure out ways to use it for yourself. So I appreciate Globin for sending this to me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I will leave all their information in my description box down below with the link and the code to save yourself some money. Um, like I said, I think this is a phenomenal box and I would love to continue to get this and see what other boxes they have to offer. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you all are doing well and having a happy end of the year and wishing you all a happy new year. And I will see all of you in my next video. Bye-bye now.